Expansive Universe is a sandbox adventure card game. At the beginning of the game, your crew is going to consist of just your alpha character. If you ever lose your alpha character, you're out of the game. That sounds kind of harsh, but this is a fairly quick game. In that time, you could have other characters to help. So you're probably gonna need more than one character. I could also attempt a mission. I have to have my crew uh, at a place. If you have the skills to do it, then you can go ahead and do it. I need to have persistence and fighting, in which I do have persistence and fighting. Hey, that means I have exactly enough. Can move a spaceship uh, from one planet to the galactic core or from the galactic core to maybe another planet controlled by another player. Occupying the galactic core and kind of having a, a show of dominance is going to let me score extra victory points. So now I want to talk about combat. It takes place either at a planet or in the galactic core. Between ships, it's going to be a space battle. Any battle that takes place at a location between characters is going to be a ground battle. And whoever has the highest is the winner. But there's a little bit more to it than that. Before we do that comparison, we can take maneuvers. These are really gonna offer a decisive advantage and they all do different things. Now, one important thing about combat, when you're carrying your crew on board a spaceship, it's very, very dangerous uh, because you could, if you lose that ship, you could like you could lose the whole crew, including your alpha character, and be completely gone. If I am able to actually transport my crew to an enemy location, I can attempt a mission there. So you get way more victory points, and you can win the game very, very fast by adventuring out. So while you can just stay home, and you're interested in winning, check out Expansive Universes. Thank you again so much, and as always, have a great day.